everybody, it's Julie Elliott. Welcome to my page if this is the first time here, and welcome back if you're returning um, to check in to see what I'm doing. Anyway, I just wanted to quickly share with you something that I was listening to today on the way to my daughter's school. I was listening to Rhonda Bryce's um, audiobook, this one here, and it's called The Hero, which has been a really great, um, a really great book or great audio. Is talking about about people's stories so far that I've gotten into it, uh, people's challenges and uh, some of the things that they went through and how they got through it. And one of the things that really spoke to me today, and I find, you know, talking to so many people recently, is um, they're waiting for that one day, that perfect time when I'm done doing this, when my kids are, you know, done school, then I'm going to do. A, B, C, whatever it is that you're, you're going to do. And you keep putting things off and putting things off. And I heard story after story after story of so many people who got to the end of their life and looked back and regretted it because they kept putting that off. Those things that you know today, you may be saying those things for yourself today. And you know what? I've, I've done that as well myself in the past. I'm like, okay, when I, when I accomplish this, then I can do this. And when I've done this, then I will start to do this. And you know what? There's no perfect time than right now, today. You need to, you know, clear that crap out of your head and start moving forward, even if it's baby steps, little steps. I've talked about this in other videos that I've done as well. Never, never put it off. Don't think that, you know, you're going to get it done when this happens, when this happens. When things start to show up in your life and you and, and those cues are starting to come in and you're you're thinking about them and you're like, oh, well, I can't do this because of this and I've got to wait till this. That is a sign. It's God, it's the universe, whatever you want to call it, and it's telling you it's time to start moving. It's started to start taking action into some of the things that you're really passionate about doing. And you know what? For me, myself, for my husband and my daughter, a lot of things um, didn't show up and really took its time. And we struggled for a long time until we started paying attention to those little cues. And as scary as and risky as some of it was, we did it anyway. And that's when everything started to change. Things started to show up. Things started to happen. Doors and opportunities started to open. You know, as many of you are familiar with our story, we know some huge successes all of a sudden popped up um, for my husband with his business, which, you know, we, we never saw coming. And just because we took that risk and those steps, things started to show up and things started to evolve. So anyway, if you're in that place today, I encourage you, I, I beg of you, don't wait, don't wait. Because you'll keep saying that and you'll keep saying that. And I don't want you to get to the end of the life. Like so many people in, in this audio book, I do recommend you, um, you get it or even the book and read it. Uh, so many great stories. Um, you don't want to be those people who get to the end and regret not taking those risks, not taking the steps. And I know that traditionally a lot of our friends and our family and, and society in general it will tell you, um, don't do it. It's too risky. Play it safe. You know, and, and that's not what life is about. It's about taking risks and living and having fun and getting out there and expanding and really pushing yourself because when you push yourself, you will grow and, uh, and other great things will start to happen. Anyway, have a wonderful Thursday and we will see you tomorrow. Bye.